Hi, kindergarten. Today's nonfiction book we're going to read is called A Fruit is a Suitcase for Seeds. And it's by Jean Richards and illustrated by Anka Harriton. A Fruit is a Suitcase for Seeds. Most plants have seeds. When you put a seed in the ground and water it, a new plant grows from it. Seeds often travel to faraway places. If seeds did not travel, too many plants would grow in one place. It would be very crowded. Some seeds travel on the wind. Some seeds travel in the water. Many seeds travel inside fruits like the pomegranate. The fruit is like a suitcase for the seeds. It protects them on their trip. Fruits look beautiful and taste good, so animals and people eat them and drop the seeds in different places. Some fruits carry one big seed inside them. This seed is called a pit, like a cherry, a plum, a peach, an apricot, or an avocado. A cherry is one of these fruits. Some fruits have many small seeds inside them. An apple is one of these fruits. So is a lemon, melon, the apple, and the pear. Some fruits have many, many tiny seeds inside them. A kiwi is one of those fruits. So is the banana and blueberries. Many berries, such as strawberries and blackberries, carry their seeds on the outside. Raspberries do too. Some vegetables we eat are really fruits. They carry seeds too. Peas are seeds. Butternut, butternut squash, eggplant, tomato, pepper, olive, green peas, acorn squash. Can you find the seeds on this ear of corn? Hint, it's the part you eat. So it's the kernels are the seeds. I'll bet you didn't know that every time you eat a peach, a cherry, an avocado, a plum, a cucumber, a tomato, a grape, an apple, an orange, a pea, a pear, a melon, a banana, or a blueberry, you're really eating a suitcase, a suitcase for seeds. And that's the end of our story. Thank you for joining me today. I'll see you tomorrow.